In the last couple of years, over one third of the Clark County road crew has retired. With the winter season upon us, there's a new group of road crew employees trained and geared up to respond to all sorts of weather-related tasks. We have lost some of our expertise as they retire out, uh, and so we are getting our new folks integrated into the knowledge and understand what their tasks are and then how to perform putting snow plows on, putting chains on the trucks, and then also where their priority routes are in each of their work areas. Besides learning primary snow routes and how to properly attach and detach snow plows, new road crew staff have also been trained on how to mix and apply de-icer. As emergency first responders that can be called out to all types of situations, there's a lot to learn working on the road crew. Part of our role for the community is keeping our roads safe. We are a first responder, so we are on call 24 hours a day, seven days a week. You never know when the next winter storm will hit. It can be ice, snow, or flooding, possibly all in the same week. Public Works begins preparing for winter when the weather is still warm and pleasant. In typical Pacific Northwest weather, we can get flooding and massive rains and also uh, down trees if we have wind events or wind and water events. So there's a lot of tree removal um, and responding to flooding or high water. To prepare new employees for dealing with down trees and limbs, Public Works put on a workshop for different circumstances they could encounter when clearing the road. Safety is uh, both for the employee and for the public is a high priority for us. We do want the employees prepared to show up out there and be ready to go and have all their protective equipment. And that's part of uh, getting geared up for the winter is making sure we have sand and uh, de-icer and also the protection that the employees need as well. The freezes and thaws of winter can cause pavement to buckle, resulting in potholes. It is the road crew that will be responding with patches and repairs to these areas. We have had winters where we haven't had snow and ice events, and then we could have one that lasts for 10 days and we get a foot of snow in part of the counties. So we've done a lot of preparation to plan for that, and we know how to split our crews up and uh, their skill sets and so that we get a good coverage around the clock. For more information on how Clark County Public Works responds to winter events, visit the county's website at clark.wa.gov slash publicworks slash winter snow and ice.